G'day my friends, it is the 3rd of April 2023, you guys are about to see No Gi, BJJ, Tiger Muay Thai here on Fitness Street. After the intro when I run that, I'm pretty much going to go straight into what we learned in the class. It's going to be about 4 minutes of Alexi demonstrating the technique. Uh, there's no actual filming of me trying to do the technique. I'm an absolute beginner in Jiu Jitsu, maybe 15, 20 lessons in my whole life. And then at the end of this video, you'll see uh, me doing some rolling with uh, one of the guys. I'm completely exhausted. Don't judge my rolling. I know it's terrible. I'm just kind of surviving when I do my rolling with people, you know, try not to get choked out, that kind of thing. And uh, yeah, I took some photos um, with um, the guy, UAE Warriors, can't remember his name, uh, that I was paired with. And he was awesome, this guy, like professional fighter. Uh, with someone like me, you know, he scraped the bottom of the barrel to pick someone like me, not knowing what the hell I'm doing, but he was extremely patient, showed me a lot of different things uh, with executing the technique that we learned in class. Hope you guys enjoy this video, a little bit of a different format. Again, four minute technique demonstration, then some rolling at the end for the no gi. BJJ class here, Tiger Muay Thai, Monday morning. Enjoy. So, now I want to grab his elbow and use my elbow to elevate his elbow up higher. So I will close it with my leg, okay? Now there is no opportunity for him to take his hand away. For sure he can push his front, but now I'm not afraid of that, okay? Because I have a lot, enough space. So I want to bring my right knee across and under his belly. So from that, uh, so from the side, under his belly. So I want to start here and move on the side. Again. Yeah. My partner starts here. I want to create the frame and move him to the opposite side. You see, so I don't put my hand anywhere else. I want to press him away. Now I can slide under his chin, pull him up and put my hand uh, on the floor. 
now you strong and pull him down as low as they can. So from that position, I need to apply a lot of pressure with my shoulder on the top of his back and hold his chin in my hand. Now I will use my foot and my hand to push that space. Uh, now I will slide under and under his belly. And close, close his back with my legs. If I will not do that, and if I will not uh, be fast enough, you can jump over. And now I'm uh, like, I lost my ability. If you will jump on that side, then my guillotine goes wrong. Uh, so, from that position, what I will do from that position. So, I'm still holding like that grip. Uh, I hold his chin, have his chin in my hand, and now I will just grab my own hand. So, I want to apply more pressure with my shoulder down. I don't want to pull him apart. I want to bend his hand down, head down. So I just want to make him lean down. And between his chin and his chest, there will be my hand. So there is the moment where we will to. So I will want to press his head down with my shoulder, okay? And at the same time, try to elevate your elbow higher. Okay? So you want to crunch like that. Uh, yeah, and once again. Slide in and press your elbow, press your shoulder down. So you want to create, you want to touch with your elbow to your knee. And elevate your left elbow at the same time. Two by two guys, be careful with the stroll please.